Greetings and welcome to another video. Today is Sunday 15th of January 2023 and as you can see I'm in Ironbridge today. This is the second video I've made this afternoon so by all means feel free to check out my previous video today and in this video just like with my previous one I'm uh, going to be having a look at the River Seven, the high water levels going on where possible. Uh, this video we're going to be look at, walking along River Seven, checking out the flood defences and the state of the, the uh, River Seven this afternoon. Uh, before I continue though, I just want to say a big mention to two lovely people I've just met a couple of minutes before recording this video. There was a really nice lady walking her dog who's seen my videos that I post on Facebook so it's really nice meeting you today uh, thank you and I'm glad you enjoy some of the videos I've made and there was a second young lady uh, in Ironbridge with a couple of her friends uh, she came over said that she watches the videos with her dad and both her and her dad really enjoy some of the stuff I do so Again, big mention to you, thank you for saying hello today, I do appreciate it. So, I hope that both these ladies have a really good day today. And, yeah, I hope that when you get time to watch the two videos I'm making this afternoon, you enjoy them. So, thank you. So, on that note, we're going to carry on with today's plan for this video. And so yeah, let's carry on. So here we are, the River the river 7 and the Iron Bridge. It's quite amazing how high the uh, river level is at the moment. And as I said in my previous video, uh, it's rather unnerving, almost scary how fast the water is flowing at the moment. They don't appreciate how fast the water in rivers flows until you see the river as it is now, basically. So, no wonder there's all kinds of warnings going on telling people to stay safe, be safe, and just be careful. So we're going to have a walk along this way, under here. And we're going to hit the main road and then just proceed from there.
Yeah, you know, it's uh, hard to imagine these flood defences, what they look like until you see them in person. In the past couple of days, I'd see mentions and photos on social media, uh, even local news. But yeah, uh, as with most other things, it's difficult to actually appreciate what's going on until you see it for yourself. And from here you can see uh, obviously the Iron Bridge itself. Quite a stark contrast between the old Iron Bridge and the flood defences right in front of me right now. It looks like I'm about to hit a dead end. That like coming along this way, I can't go any further. Yeah. Yeah, dead end, footway closed. <sighs> so from here, gonna have to Turn around. And go back up this way. Right, so since we had that dead end, if we want to travel any further along this direction, we need to well, follow that sign, pedestrians, and come up this way. I've never been up this way before. Yeah, I don't think I've been up this way before. Be interesting to see how it all goes. And yeah, good time situation. Nice little explore. Right, we're further up the hill and it's steep up that was but as you can see pedestrians gotta come up this way all right here then Random question for you, people at Iron Bridge, how do you cope with all these steep hills going on? Nice bit of exercise going on, but hey, cads, I need to go to a gym, that's for sure. I need, do need to 
go to a gym to deal with all these hills and stuff in Ironbridge. So here we are, walking along this mysterious path that pedestrian signs are pointing us along. Be good to know where it brings us out at. But there's a co-op in Ironbridge, which I want to hopefully get to. Yeah, there's a co-op in Ironbridge, which I'd like to get to, because that's got a car park, which beautifully overlooks the River Seven. So if we can get access to there, as long as it's not blocked off, we'll be fine. It's going to be good. As you can see here, you've got a public footpath, which would take us down to the uh, edge of River 7 but as you can see access denied today not surprising actually no doubt going to see a lot of that going on along different parts of Ironbridge So you're going to carry on this way and uh, yeah we're going to see where it takes us let's carry on alrighty Alvin as you can see we're coming toward the end of a path Here we are, the River Seven. A much better view of what's going on than previously. Crazy how high the uh, water levels are right now. <coughs> so, as you can see, we're back on the main road behind the flood barriers. And if we take a look around. As you can see, we find ourselves at the Malt House pub here in Ironbridge. I've been here a couple of times in the past. Haven't been here for a while. Uh, yeah, been a good few months since I was last here, but it's still a nice pub worth visiting. Alright, we're going to carry on this way uh, and yeah, see if we can get any other good access points to see what's happening on the River Seven from here. This is another good pub in Ironbridge, this one. Been here a couple of times as well in the past. Not been here for a while, but last time I was here is a very good pub. I like to be in here. 
might come back here later on see how it goes but we'll uh, see about that in the meantime we're going to carry on this way Okay, almost at where I want to be, and yeah, once we get to where I want to be, I think that'll be the point I'll start thinking about ending this video. It's been interesting, very interesting so far. So yeah, let's uh, carry on. So here we are at the co-op in... Ironbridge and what we want to do is come this way Einbridge Fine Arts Specialist Printmakers Art Gallery Printing Presses and Einbridge Fine Fine Arts well is right next to the River Seven. absolutely crazy how things are looking right now I was thinking of going to Dale End Park in Ironbridge, which is just further along the way in front of me but I don't think that's a realistic option to be honest here I wonder how long it's going to be before the River Seven returns to normal levels.
on that note, I think I'm going to finish this video here. As I said, the plan was to just walk down Iron Bridge along the uh, River Seven as best I could to see the state of things. And yeah, the part of the River Seven I'm standing at right now, uh, in the car park by Ironbridge Fine Arts. Yeah, where I am now is definitely the best example of how things are looking down in Ironbridge right now. So yeah. <coughs> Absolutely crazy. So yeah, on that note I'm going to finish this video here, thank you everyone for watching this video, I do appreciate it, I will have a good day, take care of yourselves, and uh, be safe, especially if you live in Ironbridge or you're, visit or you're visiting Ironbridge, just be safe and take care of yourselves, okay? I'll see you all soon in the next video, in the meantime... Like I just said, take care.